Duval, what is good, y'all? Duval, what is good? Jags are six and two. I've never, in all my time of being a fan of this team, I have never ever watched them be this good. I, we're not even good. Like, <laughs> not that we're not good. We 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 underperform on where we should be. Good freaking defense. We underperform on where we should be, bro. I. <laughs> I, I was talking a lot of I was talking a lot of shit with Steelers fans throughout the week. I was talking shit with Steelers fans throughout the week, right? I like I, I think Steelers fans and Bills fans are are my two least favorite fan bases so far. I, I, I don't I bro they did an amazing job. I gotta just say this now. They did an amazing job. Um, I don't know if that's Casey. I think he's the one that made all the plays, bro. He did a fantastic job of stopping Evan Ingram on, on those little uh, underneath routes that we like to run and let him get some yards at the catch. He did a really, really good job of not letting him get yards. I, I was actually very much impressed while I was watching this game. Um, but yeah, like like the Steelers fans and, and Bills fans, like I, I don't know what it is. It'd just be a lot of complaining. It'd be, it'd be a lot of talking shit and then a lot of complaining when the time comes down to be it just be complaints like like they they said you heard Deontay Johnson he said the refs the refs won us the game I I don't know if the the refs won us the game refs won us the game boy y'all throwing free cash this is seven it should be this should be a free seven that should be a free seven He said that uh, the refs won us the game. We 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 got so many calls. One of my friends um, he said that we was dirty for the hit on Kenny Pickett. Swear swear they just hit Trevor the same way. I I say I, like they should have called. Maybe they should have called a flag on on um on the on the picket play. I didn't actually I didn't actually look to see. Um, they they didn't call like a late hit on the Trevor hit. It wasn't it wasn't a late hit like. It, it, it was just he, he drove into him that I, I didn't think it was a late hit I don't think <sighs> anyways they said that the flags was was the decisive factor we had six flags in the game they had six flags like how 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 heavy were those flags that they decided what a play boy he said we got hope defense he didn't know that we got DBs that are, that are tied for what second place in the league for turnovers. Who Darius and uh and um and Cisco both tied for second. He didn't he didn't know about that. He didn't know Darius is leading the league in pass deflections. He wasn't hit to that. But 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 let him cook up. Let him cook up on the fourth string DB and the backup and the backup safety. Let him do that. Oh my God. I think that was the play where I'm on. He took a hit though. Flag or not, he took a freaking shot here. And that's the thing about Trevor, bro. Trevor takes a lot of shots. And and the reason I know Trevor isn't an elite quarterback yet is because they don't let elite quarterback take shots the way that Trevor takes shots. He takes some crazy, crazy uh hits for no reason. Maybe I got something in my eye, bro. Kinda <laughs> kinda messing with me. I can't even watch the highlights. Just try to be cute. Just, just, just try to be cute. Hold up. All right, back. My, my fault, y'all. My eye was killing me, bro. That, I, I was not gonna be able to keep going. Yeah, like, like, <laughs> in the rain. It was a good play idea. Let me stop. I like to be a hater sometimes. Let me be real here. I actually love the play idea. When it was happening, I was pretty psyched. Execution, just, just pathetic, bro. It's almost like every time we try and do some cute shit. We 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 don't just fail at it. We implode like we implode in a way that that it affects the game, and you just have to look back and say, why would you do that? But like I said, I actually like the play idea. I saw like three or four teams try that this week. I saw the Browns do it too. Love that. Oof! Quick free nine. Tim Jones did a good job today. Tim Jones did a good job. What a throw. I thought that was going to be a pick. What a throw, dude. What a throw. I mean, what a freaking dot, dude. This jump was perfectly layered. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What a quarterback. And did you know he's 6'6", bro? Good stuff. This dude is insane. Dude is insane. 
Lawrence will throw. Fake it. All right, the 10. What is he thinking? What, what, what are you thinking here? Run me, through, run me through your read. Run me through your progressions, bro. Run me through your progressions. Oh, it's not over there. I see, I see four, four black and yellow over there. Yeah, but you know, but but Rid need this contract, you know, and, and, and you know I mess with Rid and What are you thinking? What are you thinking, bro? This shit is so f No, I'm not even I'm not about to even chill out, bro. Like I would tell myself to chill out and it's not a big deal. We're in year 3. We're still doing the same dumb shit we've done. I thought we were past this phase of our career. And I said it before. I, I've said it in one of my previous. I don't remember what week, but I, I definitely said he be trying to force the ball, and he he claims he claims he doesn't need to force the ball, and he's happy to have so many options, and he's not gonna force the ball because he had so many options. But he, I'm telling you, he forces the ball. I'm telling you, this is exactly what I'm talking about, bro. This is just broad daylight he put it on display because what was he thinking? There was it wasn't even like you made any progressions here, bro. This was a straight up. I'm gonna throw this ball to Ridley, and I, I he he kind of he kind of higher than they are, so so it's gonna make it. What the hell is this, bro? What what the what the hell is that? What is that? What are you doing, bro? Yeah, I get we a better team now, bro. You, you you don't have the same threshold that you've had in years past, where if you make a mistake, we're gonna lose the game. In, in his first year, you know. Let me pause you real quick. Sorry, y'all. Because I'll be trying to explain to people and they don't understand. In Trevor's first year, if he made a mistake, we're losing the game. That, that, that's, that's, how, that's how razor thin his, 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 um, his margin of error was. Like, if he throws a pick, we 99% chance we lose that game. If he fumbles, 99% chance we lose that game. If he, even if he doesn't throw a pick, we'll still lose the, we'll probably still lose the game. But we don't have a chance. If he does, that's what it was like his first year, bro. We we were not good. We had nothing. There was nothing cooking on either side. There was nothing on offense. There was nothing on defense. There was no coaching on either side, bro. Special teams was was, was solid. I remember, um, because I used to like like the special teams coach. Uh, I think they like Dave Camillus or something like that. Um, but like back then. That there was a stretch where he stopped throwing picks. He wasn't throwing many touchdowns, but he stopped throwing picks, and I felt like he made a huge improvement, bro. Then last year, he versus the Broncos. He he does it versus the Texans. He does it against versus the Broncos, bro. And he realizes like he don't he's not gonna do that anymore. I thought we were past that, bro. We're not. We're not past that. I don't get it. I I I, I get that we have a good defense, but at the same time. You're relying on them to be like a, a a a a top tier defense, an elite defense, and they're young. They're they're good, but they're all young, bro. We got a young defense. Trayvon is he had a sack this game. Did they show a sack? I don't I don't think they showed showed a sack. Damn. Oh, what a blessing. God, what a blessing. What a blessing. We were watching this joint live. We got lucky. Got him. Oh, my God. He got him so bad. But I don't know where or why. I don't know why Pickett was not looking that way. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't usually care for the other team's quarterback much. But at the same time, we have, I'm pretty sure that's Buster Brown over there. And... I can see the number. Is that Devin Lloyd? Buster Brown and Devin Lloyd. That versus Deontay Johnson, and they're gonna get a they're gonna get a pick play. Like he knows that. I don't know why he wasn't looking. He he did slip, but I, I just gotta be a little critical of him there. I like I like uh, players like Kenny Pickett because because they throw with anticipation. I hope he's good. He had five for 60. Oh, my God. He's so crispy. He's such a good running back, bro. 
He's so quick. I'm so happy to have him on the team. I remember people were complaining. No, let me call y'all out. I'm pausing a lot, but I got to call y'all out, bro. Let me call y'all out, bro. Because there were so many people complaining when we drafted him. There were so many people after he got into the first year that said waste of a pick. Are you saying that now, bro? Do you still feel like he's a waste of a pick? Is that something you still feel, bro? Seriously? To tell me, because because he's been going kind of stupid. I haven't been hearing no waste of a pick anytime recently. So I'm just wondering, me personally. Oof, almost fumbled. He's disgustingly good. He's disgustingly good. And they had him playing up there as fifth receiver this game. Yeah, that was kind of sick. That was sick. Dude, McManus has been a huge, huge, bro, he's been so good. He's been so good. He has been so good. Got to give him his credit. He has been so good and reliable. I, I thought when we got him, like, yeah, we're going to increase our range of kicking, but Patterson was kicking so well that I felt like we were going to be giving up a lot of the shorters because Patterson was kicking, like, uh, 90, 90-something. He was, he was kicking well. And then Lambo before him was kicking really well, too. So I was like, bro, we're going to be sacrificing some of these close ones for the – yeah. For the ability to hit longer ones, no, he has been, he's been fantastic. Oh, this is so great! I did end up seeing a picture of this. Yeah, they showed it in the game. They showed it in the game. They showed like the. I don't know what 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 constitutes an offside or not offside, but I do know when you're the only one that's lined up a certain way. I feel like you deserve to get called. When everyone else is lined up a certain way behind, and you're the one person that I do feel like you should feel like okay, maybe there's something a little sus with what I'm doing. Uh, like Jawan Taylor, and he fumbled. Oh my God. Oh, this man Bigsby Bigsby stock is going down, bro. It is going down. It is going down. He doesn't play many snaps, but when he comes in, it feel like we're always in, in danger of a problem. I wish. I wish. Hey, good stuff, Joey Porter. Good stuff. I wanted to get him in the draft real bad. I'm not going to lie to you. I wanted to get him real bad in the draft. I did not know our corners were going to be balling like this. Why well, Tyson Wood? I did not know Darius Williams and Monteric Brown and Trey Herndon. He said no. That was not in. Good stuff. Good stuff, Buster. Bro. Buster has played a really, really good job. Give me that. You, you saw how Etienne came out earlier and five out sitting on the right side he just he just ran a little basic screen or maybe it was a hitch i don't know it looked like he i think he just sat there with a little fake screen or whatever um obviously they saw that play they looked they looked at the pad they said hey if we come out and five out with Etienne over here we might have something maybe that's what they thought because they came out here and trevor for some reason he's on it boy he said i'm gonna watch what the safety do flat dot Oh my god, it's such a dot. It's beautiful. Good stuff. That's Etienne versus uh, cornerback one, by the way. That's him versus cornerback one. That's him versus cornerback one. Just, just so we know, I'm, if I want to start a narrative, I'll, I'll start it. Oh, kind of lacking. Look, bro, Etienne is so tough. Look at his fit, bro. Look at this fit. The white and with the white wrapped around his shoes, he looked just like my Madden player, bro. He's so crispy, and he got the white arm belt like my Madden player. Oh my god! If I could be a football player, I'd be him. Except for the fact I gotta take mad hits, I'll be him. I'll be him first. I'll be Jay Jet a second, and then I'll be Trevor. No, I'll be Josh Allen first, and then I'll be Trevor. Lawrence takes advantage of it, and ETN finishes it off. He got by. They are going to go for two with a 15-3. Josh Allen just gets to do whatever the fuck he wants. So, like, I definitely like to be like Josh Allen. They'll they let him throw the ball 60 times. They'll, they'll be winning winning the game and throw it on first, second, and third down. Good catch. All jokes aside, Deontay Johnson played really well this game, dude. We don't have our, our, our number one corner, but I do feel like regardless, um... 
gets away for a moment. He really made a play here. And there's Deontay Johnson again. Warren in there. Trubisky, dump off. Warren's got it. Turns it upfield. Spin move. Man, shout out to our defense, dude. God, they they've been playing so well this season. Now, a part of me wants to hate a lot, so I'll get the hate out real quick. You know, he going up against a, a fucking uh, what fourth fourth string DB is Buster Brown usually on the practice squad? I don't I don't even know. I think I think he's actually on the I think he's actually uh, the fourth fifth string DB solid now. Um, you going up against a fourth string DB? You going up against uh, the the backup safety? This is gonna be the what the highlight of the year, boy. You shut my face. But I'll just decide. She was beautiful. Mm. Caught him. Mm. Oof. Oh, that was clean. Oh man. Like I said, I like Kenny Pickett, but at the same time, he's gonna have to get really smart if he wants to make the most of. Damn, that's beautiful. Dude, I mean, what what a good idea to even try this. This is the old isolation deal. Just like in basketball. Remember the good old days where Yeah, some people are just some receivers. They're just different. If he had Justin Herbert or someone crazy as his quarterback. Evan Ingram played a freaking game down the Evan Ingram played a game down the stretch today, dude. And so did, Oh, he don't want to stop go. He don't want to stop go. ETN sets up on the outside. Yeah, they ain't wanting that no more. Lawrence oh, never mind. And Lawrence will take the sack at the 41. TJ Watt. That was a terrible sack. That was a terrible sack to take. Shotgun Trubisky. Trubisky lets it fly. I just knew. I just knew the moment this ball left his hand, there was no way our defense is going to let it be a touchdown. I just knew for a fact, bruh. I knew for a fact. I, I I put this joint in the in the Reddit in the Reddit because I'd be in the Reddit. I told y'all during the game. I can't believe I've lived to see the day where Dewey is is an impact player and a captain on our team. I I can't believe it. I used to be such a big hater of him two three four years ago, bro. I used to be such a big. So I mean, he played so well down the stretch. Yo, th this is the most encouraging thing to me on the team. I'm going to get back to doing it in a second, but this is the most encouraging thing to me. You know what? I'm sorry. I I, 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 I can think of too many things at one time. Their field is so, it was so weird. It, this this was like a danger field to me. Like, like I, I didn't feel like this was safe. I didn't understand the point of it. Um, I'm pretty sure it was like grass or sod. I don't know if grass and sod is the same thing. I'll be honest. I'll be honest. I don't know. Uh, I'm pretty sure grass is sod. So I'm pretty sure it's like grass in the middle and then turf on the outside. That just seems, that seems more dangerous than just straight turf to me. I'll be honest. It, it, it seems very suspect. But in terms of Evan Ingram, it is, this is the most encouraging thing to me where Trevor can can get rapport with Ingram where they can make big plays like I see Mahomes and Kelsey doing it all the time and Kelsey is always sitting in the right spot like I, I just I need I need Ingram to be in a situation where he's similar and him and Trevor are always on the same page because if, if, if that was a thing it would make the offense so crazy where we could just we could just really try shit on the outside first and then when that all fails you just go to Ingram in the middle. Um So that's why that's the most encouraging. Like this game was really encouraging down the stretch to see that. I hope they can keep that up like forever, honestly. Literally forever. But in terms of um do we do we I can't believe I've lived to see the day where where he's a real impact player that I'm expecting things out of and he's coming through. He had some he had a crazy tackle, open field tackle. It was crazy, dude. Um He did get hopped for Ajax! Let's go! Hey, let me tell y'all something, bro. This is actually my favorite rookie on the team, Antonio Johnson. It was his birthday today, by the way, too. It was his birthday. He just he got in there. He got a pick at the end of the game, a nice little birthday present. Um, I I was actually so excited to see that on top of the game. Like that that was so cool to me. That was cool. I, I was actually hoping 
Um, I was hoping when Cisco was injured, they would let him play instead of Dewey, but obviously not. I mean, I'm pretty sure Dewey is the direct backup for Cisco, and he's more experienced. And like I said, he's an impact player at this point. And like Dewey said, dude, who who cares about anything, any of that? No complaining, bro. We are six and two. This team is playing good football. This team looks like a good football team. This is a team I can tune in every week and expect to play a good game and to win no matter who we're versing. Chiefs just dropped a six and two, bro. If they lose, we win. If Dolphins lose, we win. We can claim the first seed, bro. We we are playing unbelievably exquisite football i'm so proud of the jags dude i i don't i don't know what to say i, I they they have exceeded all expectations i'm i'm so happy with the rebuild i'm so happy with the rookies on the team i'm so happy with the direction the team's going the coaching i i, I just I'm, I'm very happy like i'm proud like i'm, I'm proud to be I'm proud to be a part of Duval, you know what I'm saying? I, I don't actually live uh, in Duval at all. Uh, I'm proud to be a part of the Jags fan base. Like, the boys are really making me proud, bro. <sighs> And I'm going to leave it at that for this week. 6-2 and two going into the bye. We come back. We versus the Niners. they they going to probably be pumped up by the time we play them. they they going to do some stuff. Like I always say, y'all, stay safe and you hear me, hear me, hear me.